Today we're here in the heart of Scarfy Land with the Otago Polytechnic students are going to show you how to create the ultimate backyard cricket experience. Well Grubby, we're out here in the middle. Uh, how's conditions looking? Uh, it's very green. Done a bit of rolling so it's quite hard. Hard you reckon? Mate, looks like I'll be walking home today. Mate, this looks awesome. What are you built here? So we've created a pavilion today. Uh, we've got some MDF boarding, a few pallets that we've whipped together, some student couches that we're going to put in here shortly, but then we've also got a white picket fence. I've got this drill. Can I use this? How about we leave that to the professionals, eh? What are you guys doing up there? Oh, we've come along to set up a zip line so we can get some overhead footage of the game and uh, we've even uh, set up our own corporate box. Yeah, I think we'll leave that one to the professionals. Yeah, I think so. Today we're doing a twist on the traditional half-time oranges by using dry ice to make your fizzy. We're also making an organic tea using botanicals forage from the backyard. Well, we heard the OP team was down a few fielders, so us designers came up with a creative solution and whipped up a few extra players for the outfield. Cool guys, so we're going to go through a few different exercises related to the cricket movements. So hopefully this will get you ready for the game. So this is the IT department. We're making an app that makes the critical umpiring decisions for us and then sends the responses out to everyone's phones in the backyard. So Craig, what are we working on here? Um, I'm just putting the finishing touches on a painting I've been making. And, and why at a cricket game? What's the relevance? Uh, we're going to try and use it to distract the opposition batsman as a sight screen. Did you boys build this from scratch? You're going to use it as a drinks cart? Man, a few words. I think he thinks he's the stig. Got here is this third umpire? Not quite. We film the game and then we analyse our players in the hopes we give them the edge. So this is Ian. He's going to be our secret weapon today. Um, part of occupational therapy is working with people to help them get involved with everyday activities. So Rihanna, who have we got here? Uh, this is Finn and Bernard and part of our course involves animal behaviour and training. So we've been training these guys up to play a bit of cricket. Right, let's see how they get on. Well, it's all over here in our ultimate backyard game of cricket between the Otago Vaults and the Otago Polytechnic students. Just remember, if it's your backyard, it's your rules. Have a great summer. <laughs>